I'm Sir Taptap, and welcome to Let's Play Reverse by Reverse. Review cap this game is provided by the publisher, which is um, Sekai Project. They they mostly do visual novels, but they actually have a couple. Um, yes, do the first game. Um, they also have a couple non-visual novels now. Um, they have this game and Rabby Ribby, which I was more interested in, but I thought I'd take this for a try. Rhythm. I see what you did there. Very self-referential. I haven't played any other games by this developer. I guess I'll just... How do I auto... Um... The icons for the menu thing aren't very useful. そう、そう。おかしくなると、お仕事たくさん。何回も壁にはまらないか確かめながら動いたりな。勘弁だぜ、まったく。いつも何ビリしてるけどね。バカ。そういうのは黙っとくのが大人ってもんなんだ。告知にチャックチャック。警告。データ領域に変化を確認。規定されたプログラムではないコード目標を情報収集からフェバック執行へと切り替えます。ゲームがま、収集した私もデータの収集でちらっと覗かせてもらうくらいで、本当に来たのは初めて。なんだあの黒い領域は。これがバグかバグフィールドみたいだね。なんだか色んなところに増えていってるみたい。ね。どうすりゃいい手当たり次第
Oh wait, hold bow. Wait. Oh, she has a double jump. Okay, I'm understanding now. Yeah, that black square, that's what bugs look like. This is, you're learning a lot about video games today. Okay, controls are a little funky. Uh, the jump button is B on an Xbox gamepad. And then special is A for some reason. You can reconfigure the controls, I just went with the default. Boink. So it's kind of like Mario. You can, you can jump on enemies anyway. It's not, what, what? Oh. Okay. Note to self, that is a thing that happens. Yeah, so you can't leave the f you can't leave the uh, screen with the other character. Ah, uh, oh, come on. Okay. All right. I'm learning. Okay. Interesting. So enemies are very dangerous, and so is that thing. What is? The... What were those lines? I guess it's just cosmetic. Rank S. Get disc. All right. We got eight megabytes of bonus data. That's almost a whole floppy disk. Wait, no, that's, that's several floppy disks actually. It's been a long time since I used floppy disks. All right. I was, I was kind of hoping that the secret of scrolling, well, the stage scroll. Oh! Oh! Rude! Okay. I, I was kind of hoping they wouldn't do the whole... Oh no, oh no, oh no. I was hoping they wouldn't have that much story every single level, but uh, I figured it's probably just for the beginning and end. Maybe an intermission in the middle, I don't know. But, wait a minute. Oh, that's pretty cool. I, oh, oh, no! I, uh, so how's this guy gonna fall? Okay, then. Why are they so slow? Alright, I'm seeing how this works. Okay, this is pretty neat. It's oh, that's like to select world and stage. We are only oop. I press B because it's the jump button. <clears throat> As you can see, I started the game earlier. I only played one level just to see how it worked. I figured not knowing the buttons could be pretty bad. Excuse me. Special actions. Yeah, we already know that. Wait, let's let's. I'll just leave it up just so you can read. Dash in the air. Can't fall mid dash. Double jump. Okay, yeah. No real special features beyond what's immediately obvious. These conveyor belts, they sure are. And those are breakable. Yeah. Okay. Ah. Okay. Wrong button is a very bad thing to press. Alright. Press the... I need to remember that A is the action, like the special action button. It feels very weird, honestly. Like I said, you can change it if you, you don't want that. I just left the default. It's not always a good idea to leave defaults. I, I notice these Japanese indie games more often than not tend to have weird. Ah, oh, god damn it! Weird mappings by default for gamepad. Which is weird because. Since PC games aren't that popular, I would think they would have more people, you know, PC gamers would be more familiar with gamepads, but I, I don't know. What ifs? Okay, let's leave you there. Alright, cool. Yes, Barky. Yes! Yes! Do you get anything special for killing those? No! <laughs> that jump being B is just messing my entire world up. What? Oh! Uh oh. No! Hold on. What? Are 
Are you? No. Voice acting is pretty cute. Wait, what? Backwards? Since when? What? Oh, the time is how how many seconds it scrolls, I get Huh. Okay. I hope you guys are on the right sides. Or whatever. Oh, oh. Okay. Hmm. Oh, by the way, this is said to have 81 levels on the Steam store page, it said, so uh I guess that's a decent length. Multiplied by the length of the levels we've got so far. I mean, obviously these are the shortest levels in the game. <clears throat> Holding off the screen. The red things can damage you no matter what. I was wondering why they were red. Yeah. Uh, this is one of my cousins up here. We just need to make sure that we're not active and it'll be fine. See? Why did it go backwards? Oh, because of the bounce, I guess? <laughs> That's neat that you can do that. Alright. Oh, oh, whoa, wait, wh where did you two come from? Hold on. Pardon me, but what? Also, hang on. Whoa. Oh, you're supposed to switch people. Okay, I, I think I get it now. Kill, yes. Okay. I understand now. Killing things does not give you data. Alright, I understand. Whoa, hold on! Fr ah! Panic because of the stupid spike balls. Isn't it crazy that this is exactly how all video games are debugged? It really makes you think. Really makes you think. Boop. Okay. I was worried that this would be like super rage quitty, but it's not. At least, not so far. The the Steam description brags about how hard it is, so I assume it gets pretty brain hurty. Uh, for, I wanted to get the discs. We only got an. Uh, we got a rank eight. It's not a B. That's clearly an. That's clearly an eight. Whatever. I want to clear at least one world. I'm not sure how many levels are in the world. I'm gonna guess nine at most. What is this? Oh! Oh god. Holding down synchro and jump is really hard with these default controls. They probably should have been. I wondered if we would like land on each other's feet, but no. It's probably too level breaky. Um. It would probably be best if, like, Synchro and Switch were mapped to the uh, triggers or the, like, shoulder buttons or whatever. Wait. Oh, fr ah! I, I knew what I was doing. I just didn't need to move quite that yet. Quite that yet. How do I reset? Pause is the left. Pause is L. It's the L button. So I I'm pretty sure these are just random mappings, basically. It uses all the face buttons at least. So that's. This is where the game gets hard, apparently. No, don't, no! Okay. I'm only gonna play this for, like, I don't know. I just do the quick look, so I'm probably not gonna play this too much longer, but if I were, uh, I mean, when I, when I continue playing, I'm definitely gonna remap first. Ah! Because, yeah, the default controls, definitely gonna wanna remap. Yes, Parker! I gotta press Y, I gotta press X and B to do a twin jump. 
which is obviously not ideal. I assume when we're in synchro, we can both be hurt, which is bad. Oh, frick! Ah. Okay. So this is definitely where the game pulls out the stops. I need to see what if there's like a boss fight or like what the, what the end of the worlds do. It's not what I meant to do in terms of. Oh no! Frick! Okay. They could have started with an easier level to teach me the synchronization, because this is pretty tricky. I may have just played myself, I'm not entirely sure. Yeah, I. Well, I can't get all the data off. Frick. Alright, hold on. I'm, I have to remap this. This is. Ugh. For one thing, that pause button is not remotely sane. Alright, config start. Uh, confirm, cancel, special. Okay, that will be much better. I, I should have done that first, I apologize. We're only on stage six. Okay. And I have the bumpers and X and A, which are the keys I would generally recommend using. If you only got four inputs. So that way you can access everything without moving your hands on anything. Still not used to switching quickly. Okay. I wonder if we're both active, can can one of us be hit? Uh. No! Ah, oh, frick! I'm using the old control still. Ah, no! Any game that requires controlling two players has this point where it's like, oh god, my brain. I've kind of already reached it, but I mean, <laughs> you get better. It's just... This is my first time playing, obviously, so... Uh, not there yet. Fuck! Uh, I can't think which button is which! It's, it's just the switching that's killing me, because I'm like, which button? Which button do I do? I'd be doing better if I had just mapped the buttons right from the beginning. Which is why default configurations matter, by the way. It's probably best if you don't play this in synchronized. Yeah, this is the stage is better if you don't move synchronously. Cause that just melts your brain. There we go. Okay. At least we got S rank, so I never have to play that level again. Okay. I have a feeling that's only gonna get worse after that, though. The voicing's very cute, though. Um, I think I need to be dashy. Oh! There you go. So, the game still has tricks of its sleeve, obviously. Not sure. Oh! Duh. Hmm. 
not sure how to get to that one thing. Like switching in midair, maybe? I don't know. I don't need all the discs, though. I just want to see the end of the first world. What is this? What is this? Forced tethering? Okay. Oh. Oh goodness, what? How do I get that? I... Uh-oh. Dead. Oh, wait. No? Hold on. Obviously not a good clear, but that works, I guess. Alright, what button is auto? ここはゲームの表層じゃなくて、内部のデータ空間だから、プレイヤーが遊ぶ領域じゃねえんだけどな。思ったより楽しいところだね。遊べるようになってるし、よくわかんねえな。1ワールドは内部でも簡単なもん
was my bad. Come on. This would be interesting to speedrun, because I'm sure you can move way faster if you use synchronized movement. And I... I'm not tough enough for that. Alright. Speed level, nothing fancy. Pete's sake. I'm getting fancy. By which I mean dying a lot. Why does this even remove this block? It's it's not impeding anything. Whatever. I guess they don't have to actually help. They're just collectibles. Alright. Sweetie. Go away, bunny spawners. Alright. Whatever, I don't need the data. Screw the data. Alright. Take a quick peek at this, but I'm not gonna play it. Uh, I'm doing bad enough. This is why I don't... ...play the puzzly games. First, like, blind. It's really fun, but it's it's just, it's just me failing a lot, and I'm not sure. Like I don't like to scream and rage and stuff. What what, what were those? Oh, these like disappear. And, like they solidify after you go through them. That's new. Oh, I accidentally completed it. I lied. I'm sorry. I. I must commit Sudoku for lying to you. But yeah, this is reverse times reverse, or however you say that. It's very cute and it's on Steam.